determining the um, likelihood of recommending dental intervention when a patient is receiving cancer therapy needs to be individualized. You need to know what's going on in that patient's mouth, and that's why including a dentist is very, very important in the overall treatment plan. If the patient has an abscess brewing in their mouth, that needs to be addressed before you administer the chemotherapy that it's going to make them neutropenic because they then are going to be at risk. There are patients who need to have teeth removed because they are in such poor condition. That also is better to accomplish when they have an adequate white count and platelet count than when you have initiated treatment. Now with that said, if the patient's in the middle of treatment and they say, oh, I have a terrible toothache, you do not say, well, we can't send you to the dentist now, your white count's too low. You need to find out what's going on in there and a dentist who understands neutropenia and oral cavity management needs to be included in that assessment process.